I am, I don't know what's going on with my hair today, the humidity, I am such a smack ass because I just did like this 11 minute, like 12 minute video and I, you know, I stopped the tape, or I stopped the recording and I forgot to press publish, press publish, whatever, and um, I don't feel like sitting up all proper and doing it again. I had on like nice earrings and everything. I talked about them, but I don't care anymore. I'll do it. Um, I had to review them. I got a bunch of jewelry. I got to review anyway, so I'll just take pictures for it and put it in my review blog. But um, decided to do a video every Thursday, even though it's I have like the shortest amount of time to get a video done. I don't edit my stuff, so it, it doesn't matter. Um, it's raining out. It's supposed to get better. The sun's supposed to come out. I think it I think it already did. I don't know. I haven't checked in a while. Um, I actually today got paid for writing a blog, an advert, like an advertisement for a um, website. They're in the UK, but I mean, my, because of the fact, that's okay because of the fact that, you know, it's good to write about other countries and what, how they handle their gaming websites. And I talked about gambling, but, you know, you gotta, <laughs> in this economy, you gotta do what you gotta do. I always said that I wouldn't, like, try to get paid for anything from that site or try to get money but you know I have a student loan I'm trying to pay off I need extra money so I can have something to like if I want to go out with my friends or something I don't want to be stuck in the house all the time just because I said I'd take I'd take a break from drinking and partying and all that stuff um I still want to have a girls night out and you know Go to, or go to a nice dinner with a, with a friend or something, or go do stuff with Lexi. Um, anyway. Uh, yeah, not much has been going on. And I've this ugh, yes yesterday was a trip because I did not know that it was illegal for y you to have your trash cans out on your front lawn in my town. And suddenly the township decided to make it illegal. And we got a citation for it yesterday. And, um, apparently you have to keep them, like, keep the trash cans as far back from the front next to your house. Or the recycling has to be in, in the far back corner of the house where you can't really see it. And the trash bags have to be in the backyard or something like that. We just got cited for it yesterday, and, um... What really pisses me off about my town is that as days go by, like as years go by, they try to, you know, treat it like it's a freaking private community, and it isn't. There's a private community down the road from me that they tore down, like the only forest we had in our, um, in my area, or in the town because all they want to do is pave over every little bit of land that they can in New Jersey and make like retirement communities and private communities and all that stuff private housing and private housing yeah you know developments private developments have roles that you have to follow but that's you should already know that before you go get one but just the suburbs of a town you know, because we have like we have apartments and we have suburbs. We don't really have city 
we don't have like a main street or anything. We're too small. We're too small for it. Burlington City has a main street. There's there's like the city and then there's the suburbs. And um yeah, it's like that baffles my mind because my dad was like, I knew they were gonna do that. I saw that fat bitch pointing out stuff in our lawn and I was just like, boy. I mean, it's not a big deal to, you know, like, oh, just move the cans, but good God. I understand if our lawn was, like, unkempt and the grass is really long, that's one thing, but anyway. I really want to get a copy of Clayton Littlewood's new book, Goodbye to Soho. But it's not on Amazon.com yet. Dirty White Boy is. And hopefully, I should ask him when the heck it's going to be on Amazon. We'll talk about that later. I'll talk about Dirty White Boy too. But anyway, I don't want to have this be like another long ass rambling blog post. Um debating on whether or not I'm going to do a vlog for my review channel or just take pictures like I usually do. It's actually easier just to make a video, but I like, but I think this, I like, I guess I like writing reviews and having the pictures nearby, like, cause it's, cause then you can see like the swatches and you get to see, get to really look at what I'm reviewing, especially since I've been doing mostly makeup. And anyway, I'll, yeah, I'll probably just do my regular blog for that. And I have, I just got a new, my last palette that I'm going to buy. And I have one more palette coming in. Um, my other sleek palette that I ordered. And then I'm done with makeup palettes. I'm good. I don't have, I don't store like freaky colors. Like I know Sleek, Sleek is a UK brand. It's like a drugstore brand. I don't know. I, I can never like buy, they have something called an acid palette and it's like neon colors. If I were in high school and if I went to a lot of parties or something, I'd, or Halloween, maybe I would do that. But I don't want, I would never use it because I'm, I like natural colors. I don't like anything too freaky unless it's like, unless, unless I'm, unless it's Halloween, but I'm not going to buy something. I'm not going to spend all my money on something I only use once a year. And I bought all that makeup because basically applying makeup is like my version of art therapy. It calms me down. Like just doing my makeup, trying new things, it calms me down. Talking about it, it's like a, it's just a hobby of mine and I'm, oops, I have a really bad addiction to eyeshadow and just makeup stuff and, and a spec in general, but especially eyeshadow, it's like the first, it's like at the top of the list. And, um, just, you know, not being afraid to play around with it and see what comes up. I don't do, like, on Pixie Woo, they do, like, those, she's like, alright, I don't know what's going to happen, I'm just going to, you know, wing it, and then she comes out with something really... <laughs> really bright like I do have bright colors in some of my palettes but you know I guess it would be good for nightclubs too but anyway I'm doing like boring ra ass rambling so Katie shut up um all right so I will see you guys next Thursday um hopefully we I'm still mad about that citation. I really am. It's unbelievable. So, okay. I don't have my glasses on. Can't see a thing. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys.
next week. Have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.